Morning YouTube, this is Dave with Lost Farms Homestead. Um, we're at the house in town right now. We're in the garage. We're going to do some uh, bottle cutting and a little bit of cleaning. So I don't know if you can see back here. I'm not trying to show you guys everything that's in my place, but uh, this is what happens when you spend weeks and weeks and weeks up on your property building and doing stuff and you neglect the things that are in your house. So, yeah, this, this is a little bit of a mess right now. Well, say hi, love. Hi, love. So, we are going to spend the day today um, Hope's going to cut some bottles and I'm going to clean this giant mess. So, um, yeah, yeah, a little self-explanatory. So, um, I'm going to set the camera up over here and I'll try to get you guys a view of her cutting while I'm cleaning and I'll do the best I can to get it in the shot so you can see what we got going on. And, uh, yeah, we'll get it done. So, keep watching. Oh, hey, look at that. Stained glass paint. Hold, hold on a second, let me... Oop, wrong way. Uh, nice. Those are pretty. Alright. Yeah, it was weird. Yep. Alright, so... Oop, jeez. Technical difficulties. Oh, but you're old. Yeah, it's it's because I'm old. <laughs> All right, keep watching. Thanks.
right, so this is where we ended up after a full session of cutting. Um, we got so we cut all of these today, and then we have this crate full of uh, leftovers from the last time that we cut, and uh, that's that's where we're at right now. So we're gonna. Yeah, and we have some specialty ones also that we did for a friend who asked us to cut them. We're going to be uh, making glasses. Yeah, we're going to be making glasses. We'll be sanding and buffing the the rims in order to make glasses for a couple of friends. We had one who asked for the gray goose, and then also for some uh, wine bottle ones. There, uh, they'll be nice green color for the restaurant. So, but. So we're going to get cleaned up and shower and then go pick some things up in town real quick. We need more duct tape so we can finish this out. And we'll leave these out here and let them dry in the meantime. And then we'll come back and pair them all up and then do some taping. And, and uh, we'll get you guys in on that. And then I'll finish cleaning up inside as well. So once we get to that point. So keep watching. Thanks.
finished um, yeah most of this cleaned up in here uh, I, and right now I just kind of need to pass a broom and then set the gym back up I think I'm gonna hang the bag today I think I'll do that I have not had the bag for quite a while and I miss it so I think I'm gonna hang it up but here so these are all the uncut bottles and this is the cutting station cutting and grinding station and these are all of the cut bottles but we've got kind of a pile of stuff right here and this is just stuff I mean it's a little embarrassing but I mean it's piled up it's not gonna fall over and I'm waiting to get rid of it so that stuff is there and this is all the canning stuff right here it's out of the way so we got animal food here uh, this is the stuff that we bring with us to the uh, property when we go. A lot of times we bring the cooler and, you know, this is water and drinks. And then I got some fasteners and other stuff that we're going to bring out when we come out. This is the job site radio here that we bring. And then the rest of this, this is all canning stuff. So we've got several jars in here. And this is the vacuum vacuum seal packing stuff and then we got weights for the fermenting back here um, this is all uh, like uh, this is all lids rings lids all of that kind of stuff here and then this one here this is all of the uh, the tadler lids so resealable lids we got rings hundreds of rings back here different size rings different size caps so that whole container back there that's nothing but lids and rings all of it so that's for that and then we have all the jars here and we try to use a lot of WEC jars um, I don't know if you've seen these before but these are the uh, European type where they're uh, these are resealable so they come with these little these little clips right here and these clips just pop off and back on and they're resealable and you can use these over and over and then these I believe you can use the rubber seal up to 10 times so you just put a mark with a sharpie on it each time you use it up to 10 and then you throw it away but we've got several more of these so and we have various different size different style of jars there's one here that we've used here this size and then we've got the big one here this guy so that's nice for juice we use it for apple juice mostly but and then there's a uh, different I guess that's the same as the other one that I just had but yeah we have several different size and style of jars of the WEC and then we have all of the regular jars that we use so we've got canning all set up for whenever we do that and then we have our uh, beer and mead section over here this is where we keep all of that so and then the freezers here so this this is just the camping gear here training gear 
for martial arts training and then just the tools but this here is the gym so I'm gonna clean up the gym and get the gym set up and then uh, we'll be done so hang out Last night we went through and showed you um, what we had finished on the bricks that we did but when I went back and watched it it was really dark and you couldn't see anything at all so I'm going to show you now what we did so you can see here we got a whole this is one full case right here of finished bricks there are six inch bricks two deep so you can see there's one in down in there and then one on top so these are two deep all the way through there's a full case here this one's kind of a bunch of different stuff and this is where we're we got the light blue right here this is really nice so we're keeping that kind of separate but this is a bunch of odds and ends parts so and then this one is almost all the way full we got some spaces back here and then uh, this is all of the big bricks that we did the uh, um, Patron and I think this is like Goldschlager. Uh, yeah, nope, that's tequila. There's some other bigger ones in here. These ones are Patron here. I think that's, nope, that's tequila also. But, and this one's the Don Julio. It's kind of a blue color. It's a nice bottle. So, and that's too deep. And then there's this one. And this one also is too deep. We got a bunch of green ones in here, some other different colored ones, a uh, frosted one here, and there's another green one, so, but this, this is full, too deep also, and then this one is all of the beer bottles, these are the smaller ones, um, green, brown, white, so I think, I think we have a, no, or we don't, I thought we had a cobalt one, but I guess we don't. And then these are the big bricks, the big ones that are flat that we're using for the shelves in the shower. So, and there's all of those. And then over here, this is our crate full of mismatch stuff right here. And then you can see the duct tapes on there. So, but yeah, so let's see, we got one, two, about three, three, one, two, three, and then a couple halves, and then the beer bottles, so like maybe probably three and a half, four cases, I'd say. So we did pretty good for one cut session, so that turned out pretty all right, I think. So anyways, so I just wanted to show you that because the other footage came out just dark and you couldn't see anything, so all right, thanks. All right, so we said we'd get you a look at the glasses when we finished them and this is what they asked for 
so this is what we got they are uh, tall large gray goose glasses my understanding is that these are going to be for white russians so those are some big russians <laughs> all right so <clears throat> Yep, that's what we're working on, and then we got the wine ones that we'll be doing also for the restaurant, so. Uh, stick around, we'll show you those. All right, so that was a workout. Who needs a gym, right? <laughs> All right, so this is what we got. Yeah. So compared to what it was before, yeah, this, this is a little bit of a mess right now. Oh, and how it is that? now. So, yeah, we got some bottles cut and we got the garage cleaned out. So, excellent. All right. Uh, yeah, I'm going to go shower and uh, close it down. And... Uh, yeah be done for the for the week so um stay tuned we're going to be going next week i got john set up to come with me up to the property and we're going to do some uh some more bags up there and uh yeah so sorry i'm whew, it's hot it should not be uh, it should not be this hot in the middle of november Anyways, so, yeah, so stick around. We'll see you next week. Thanks for watching.